Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Angel Snazzy Snaz Snaz, Snazzy Bear Snaz, the Snaz, this isn't an angel, or the Snaz Bear Angel Snaz. Um, so today we're going to be playing Plague Inc., which is an early access game on Steam, which you can get for yourselves, I believe. Uh, I'm not sure how much it will be in dollars, but yeah, we so obviously we haven't unlocked the virus yet, or the fungus, or the parasite. Ah, oh, there's all these awesome evil looking things but we got a crappy bacteria so we're gonna make a bacteria because we have no no choice really have we so un insert gene and they're all they're all bloody locked so i guess we'll have to play the game to unlock them casual normal brutal no one washes their hands research doctors don't work sick people given hugs oh, that's nice okay yeah what we're gonna do is we're gonna go for the casual mode just to, to have a look. Name my plague. Okay, what should I call it? Okay, I think we're gonna call it the Doge virus because it's gonna be Doge basically that infects people's computers and then it makes them ill. You are a new bacteria. To win, you must evolve and spread across the world, wiping out humans in the ultimate plague. Search a country to begin your plague. When you click on it, you can see more information. Um, oh that. Right, despite what's currently going on with Russia and whatever it's called, I'm not going to start there because that's just in bad taste. Um, let's start in... Oh, wow. The USA has a huge population. Of course we're going to start in the USA. Look at all that. It's like, fr it's like what? Like a third the size of Canada. It's got 309 million people in it. Hell yeah. So what do we do now? The Dodge virus begins in USA. The Dodge virus has infected its first human. Weak and unspecialized, it must evolve using DNA points to infect more people. So currently we're in one person. There's a, there's a plane, there's a mul bunch of planes flying around, or a boat, I think that is. Right, so what the hell do I do? Let's have a quick look. Business as usual. So only one person's ill. It's not really done anything yet. The Dodge virus. Okay, so this must be how we uh, upgrade it. So how are we going to upgrade? Whoops, did I just do something by accident? How many, I've got one DNA point. Okay, so I guess we need to just wait for it or something. Infectivity is pretty low, so we need to upgrade that though. Infectivity has gone up. Transmission. Uh, Air one, nine DNA points, 12. Right, so how do we get DNA points? Do we just wait for it to like spread a bit? What, what I think would be a really cool idea is if it like, if it was this all like like 3D kind of. What's that? Pop orange DNA bubbles to get DNA points. Okay. Pop orange DNA bubbles when they randomly appear to get bonus DNA points. So that's how we get them. We've got four now. So we just got to chill and wait to get some more. Oh, we got another one then as well. So I guess we just wait for the virus to like, or bacterium. So, oh, hang on. Okay, so I'm guessing these little red areas are where our little doge bacterium is like hatching its- Oh, there we go. Oh, this is brilliant. Right, so okay, the little red splotches are obviously our virus spreading. Danish Mafia becoming too powerful. And <laughs> we can do something about that. Can we actually like move the, the virus? Has it gone anywhere except from the USA? It's like medicine in USA slowing infection. USA is infected. Oh crap. You, okay, I've got a drug involved to like resist drugs. So see if we've got drug resistance. Um, symptoms, abilities. Heat resistance, drug resistance. Oh, we need two more DNA points, so let's just uh, let's watch our bacterium just grow a bit. The Dodge virus begins to spread. The Dodge virus is spreading from person to person in the United States of America and will grow exponentially. Exponentially. You control the plague indirectly by evolving it. Right, so let's just give it a chance to like spread and give us some more. We need one more point until we can get rid of that drug resistance. There we go. Right, let's give it drug resistance abilities. Drug resistance evolve. There we go. Oh, another poppy bullet. You have successfully evolved the Doge virus. You have spent DNA points to evolve your disease and more options have opened up. Get more points by popping DNA and biohazard bubbles and infecting people. Has it spread anywhere else yet? Like, uh, besides the USA? Tip, think what would happen in real life. Plague Inc. is a hyper-realistic model of the world. Plan your strategy and evolve your disease accordingly by spending DNA points. 
So right now they'd be like, everybody needs to wash their hands, but apparently like no one has any hygiene in this ver in this m game mode. I mean, there's loads of these planes like flying in, like between the infected areas, but for whatever reason, it's not spreading. So why isn't it spreading? Do you think it's like because it's changing the uh, area? I was only 51 people infected. That's why. 57. It's growing. It's growing. So everyone's like. <laughs> Obviously, hardly any people wash their hands nowadays. Symptoms. Uh, let's just see. Anemia. Decrease. Uh, rash. Slightly increase in infectivity. Yes, we're going to do that. Sweating. Um, more dangerous in cold countries. Um, hang on. Oh, hang on. There we go. We're going to get coughing. Nausea. Oh. Ugh, disgusting. If someone's got this disease and they kiss their loved one, their loved one's gonna contact this virus and they're gonna become Dodge. Oh, that'd be awesome. We're gonna pretend that this disease makes people become Dodge if they get, like, infected. So it's like a zombie virus with Dodge. To find out more about a country, I guess it's gonna tell us, like, what's it gonna tell us? Uh, information, healthy. Yeah, okay. Huh. I'm guessing that's like medical research then, is it? It's pretty cool. But I thought it'd like tell us about the uh you know actual like temperatures and stuff, like obviously that would be called the Dodge virus infects hundreds. The Dodge virus has infected several hundreds in USA, increasing the chance that an infected person will infect a healthy person. Keep evolving your disease. This is badass. How many people? 269? 289? So we're growing. We're slowly taking over the United States of America. Okay, so let's, um... Soon, everybody in America will be Dodge. Evolve, right, okay. Let's just wait for some more disease points. Oh, hang on, there's some bubbles. Go on, start spreading, please. Just gotta wait for it. Little horrible-looking red spots. Infected. I, I doubt they can cure it then. In this mode. Okay, I think we can upgrade this now. What's this do? Abilities. Bacteria resilience. Create bacteria shell to protect against all climates. Resistances. Uh, birds. Oh, hang on. Land transmission. Rats. Um. Okay, I'm just thinking here. Uh, give passion. Of course, that's brilliant. Because at the moment, people can sneeze and cough. So if we make it so it can like transmit via like the air, then people can go, oh, oh, and it's gonna be like swarming around the air. Has it spread yet? I guess it'll tell us. It you like if this is like that game. Uh, what's that game? Infection. It, if you, it's a game online, basically, it's an online browser game. It's very similar to this, extremely sim similar to this actually. I'm not sure if this is by the same people or not. But, um, basically, it usually tells you. The fact Dodge virus has infected thousands in USA. People are being infected faster and faster. Glorious. 7,900, 8,000, 9,000, over 9,000 infections to boot. 12. Wow, it's, it's spiraling out of control since I like upgraded it. I didn't know, like, giving it the ability to, like, fly around the air was actually, actually, like, that much of a deal. Has anyone gone on holiday yet to, like, spread it? So, uh, let's upgrade it. What we'll do is we'll upgrade it, because I'm not sure if it's because it's in a different climate. So, if someone goes on holiday, it's not surviving. So, we'll, uh, give it the ability to survive over climates. There we go. So, let's evolve that. Bacterial shell thickened. Uh, so, we'll, we'll leave that for now. Because it should actually now it should actually start destroying other cl other areas because it should be resistant to climates. The game's called Pandemic. Sorry, the one I was thinking of. Oh, pop red red infect bubbles to get DNA points. Red infect bubbles appear when you infect a new country. Okay, brilliant. Pop them to get bonus DNA points, which you can use to evolve your disease. So, which country have we've infected? We've infected Mexico, which is brilliant. So, well, it's not brilliant. But obviously it's not a real game, it's not real. But yeah, the game I was thinking of is called Pandemic. It's like a browser-based version of this. Kind of. It's free. It's free as well, so you don't have to buy that. 
So if you want to get a feel for what the game is, uh, have a go at that. It's really good. Oh, hang on. An infection line. Oh, we've we've got to the United Kingdom. Brilliant. It's home. I hope he doesn't get me. I don't want to get sick. Oh, we're in Canada as well. Oh, brilliant. Okay, the, so far the virus, or bacteria even, the disease is actually spreading pretty well, actually. Four million people are infected. Holy crap. A rash? Okay, we've upgraded that. Let's give it some more abilities, actually. Um, Pathogen? Nope. Uh, symptoms? Fluid discharge through sneeze. Sneezing greatly infected. Okay, yes. I'm just seeing which one inf... In Oh, hang on. Right, that's fatal. Okay, cool. What's this one here? Cysts. Uh, uh. Okay, we'll get that one. That's nasty. That's disgusting, actually. Our disease is getting even stronger. Oh, we're in a new country as well. We're in a... Where are we at now? Sudat. No, that's... More, inf more infectious than TB. Wow. The Dodge virus has infected more people in the world than TB. It's a very infectious disease. It is... You know, such disease, much, much cough. Wow. I should make, like, a thumbnail with Doge face on it. That looks horrible. That actually looks like an illness. 27 million, 30, 33 million, 40 million. Holy crap, the USA is just... It's just go... It's just... Bloody hell. That's crazy. And my disease is just... They're about to get wiped out. More infectious than HIV. The Doge virus has infected more people in the world than HIV. It is an extremely infectious disease. That's crazy. It's not even fully upgraded yet. And we're already destroying the entire world. The USA is like half infected. But no one's dying. Of course no one's dying. Because we haven't given it any abilities to kill anyone. Hang on. Um, symptoms. Right, let's... Now it's fatal. It is actually potentially fatal now. Um... Great power. Freedom of mutation can be lethal. Severity. Okay, we'll go for that one next, which is 18 DNA points. Oh, new minor disease spreading. In the normal checkup, a doctor in USA found a new disease, which has been named the Doge virus. It appears to be mostly harmless, but must be investigated further. Other countries are also reporting this disease. Yes. This must be how real diseases go ahead. Like soon, the entirety of like, the United States of America will be infected. USA starts working on cure. Oh, oh shit. Without greater funding, it is expected to take a long time. Okay. First death from the Doge virus has been confirmed in the USA. Bad luck for the beginning of some... Bad luck or the beginning of something terrible. The beginning of something extremely terrible. Oh, are we in Russia now? Okay. Enjoy that, Putin. Regards. Okay, apparently 100% of Americans are actually infected with this, like, disease now. Almost 100%. Um, oh, is that a new infection? Yes, several new infections. We need one more DNA point to make it extremely fail and potentially deadly. Canada's doing pretty damn well, actually. And so is uh, Brazil. Argentina's still not... See, these areas here, they're still not infected. Why? Caribbean, the Caribbean's been infected as well. So, oh, vomiting symptom mutated. Oh wow, the Doge virus has mutated and developed this vomiting symptom without needing DNA points. That's brilliant. And not for the people like that have got it though. There we go, we can upgrade this virus now. Let's give it that ability, which is pretty bad. Um, immune suppression. Pathogens attached to lymphocytes, suppressing immune system and allowing significant gra significantly greater freedom of mutation can be lethal. Hang on, let's have a look. That seems to be the most leaf. That adds more severity and whatnot. Let's just give it that. Should increase the death rate. See, I'm not sure if these infected numbers are going down because of the dead or if they're actually getting, like, cured or something. Whoa, the Dodge virus becoming scary. The more scary the Dodge virus becomes by hurting and killing people, the harder humans will try to cure it. Remember this when involving your disease. Right, so we basically need to give it as much resistance as possible at curing and medicine, medication. We haven't seen me getting any of these bubbles lately. There's the one. Speaking of the devil, new infection areas. Let's keep it going. Russia isn't really infected though at the moment. Oh, a spot too soon. The Dodge virus killing very fast. P 
people are dying in Italy faster than new period people are being infected. Holy crap, really? Let's have a look at that. 20. Are you sure? I, that doesn't seem right to me. USA shuts down land borders. USA has become the first country to try to limit the spread of the Doge virus by limiting access into and out of the country. Time will tell if this will work. Unfortunately, I doubt it will. Oh, gotta keep. Apparently, you gotta click the bubbles before they disappear. Oh, snap. Right, let's, uh. Let's get this. Oh, great, the virus again. Let's give it some more abilities. Um. Develop. Yep. Okay, we got seven more DNA points. We'll get rack up some more before we upgrade again. Hopefully, we start racking up more points a bit faster because at the moment it seems to be a bit slow. Oh, Canada's Canada's like doing very badly. Whoa, rich countries have adopted new health guidelines, which will make them which will make them less vulnerable to disease. So yeah, the countries are starting like go. Oh shit, we better like protect ourselves. The Finland are doing all right. Apparently, no one's going to, to Greenland though. Cool little Iceland over there, it's not doing too well. New Guinea. Whoa, look at Canada. Canada's fallen. The, do the Doge virus placed on watch list. Shouldn't that have been, like, already dangerous? Governments are warned that it could become unstoppable. Shouldn't they have already, like, done that? The fact that, like, 100% of Americans are actually infected with this disease. And, like, UK, France, Ireland, Germany. Holy crap. This is unstoppable. There's no way people are going to recover. I mean, Greenland isn't even affected, for God's sake. Greenland's going to like be, be the only people alive after the, at the end of this. Symptoms. Um, total organ failure. Holy shit. Yes. Coma. Yes. Okay, so this is going to make people comatose. And what was the other one? Organ failure. Holy shit. This is a pretty nasty disease. So yeah, this game isn't really for the faint-hearted, but it is educational at the same time. More infectious than the common cold. The Doge virus is infecting more people in the world than the common cold. It is the ultimate infectious disease. Doge. Unstoppable. So yeah, this, I wouldn't recommend this if you, like, you know, if you've obviously fell victim or been close to people, obviously, have had issues with disease. Most of us, uh, killed more than the Black Death. Holy crap! New statistics, statistics show that the Doge virus has killed more than 75 million people worldwide. Worse than the Black Death. All these infected planes and chips. It's crazy. Oh wow, Canada's like about to fall. Tip, fight the cure. There are. Oh, we've actually gone to Greenland. There are two ways to fight development of the cure. Evolve aggressive symptoms to destroy countries more noticeable, or evolve cure resistance less noticeable. Let's keep going. USA. Killed more than Spanish flu. Wow, that's amazing. Right, let's keep going. Um, let's upgrade the virus again. Give it some more strength. Make it more evil. Pneumonia. Just have a look, see which ones are more lethal. Right, we're going to go for that one, and then we're going to go for that one, and then we're going to go for... That's not actually that bad. I mean, it is bad, but it's not as bad as the other ones. Like, infectivity, we can increase that. Diarrhea, there we go. Lovely diarrhea. Horrible, actually. Right, so, so far, a disease is actually destroying the entire planet. South Africa leading global cure effort. South Africa has started to send research teams to infected countries hoping to speed up development of cure for the Doge virus. Pop blue bubbles to destroy their research. It's a bit evil. Pop blue, okay. Where's the blue bubble? Oh, okay, he's destroy that cure. Whoops. Killed more than smallpox. Holy crap, 300 million worldwide. That's crazy. Destroy that. Thank you, backup. I hope you don't get infected with this disease. Car Caribbean begins to break down. Normal life is Caribbean in the Caribbean is beginning to break down. To oh shit. Oh wow. So this is actually wiping out the entire planet. So yeah, as you can see, this is a, this is a very good game. It's pretty damn addictive actually. And I can only imagine that you know if you're playing on a harder mode, then obviously you're going to be doing well it's going to be a lot funner because you're going to have people actually resisting the cure as opposed to just seeing how fast you can actually spread the virus so overall i do recommend this game so definitely worth one one worth picking up 
So, thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this video, please sure leave a like and subscribe. I have been Angel Snares. Thank you for watching. Till next time. Save game. Save game. There's some new evil actually. Plague Inc. 1.